Title, Reflections of the Damned The desolate town of Rainwood, an unrelenting storm had drenched the streets for weeks, casting a perpetual gloom over the once bustling community. At the heart of the town stood a decrepit Victorian house, its windows fogged and its walls stained with the passage of time. Within its decaying embrace, a young girl named Emily sat alone, staring out into the rain-soaked abyss. Emily was no ordinary child, her pale skin and hollow eyes spoke of unspeakable horrors. She lived in isolation, her only company the reflection of a girl in the window, her twin sister, Lily, who had vanished without a trace one stormy night. The townsfolk whispered that the house swallowed her whole, a victim of the malevolent spirits that roamed its halls. Each day, Emily sat by the window, hoping to glimpse Lily in the reflection, to assure herself that her sister was still with her in some form. But today was different. As the clock struck midnight, the reflection changed. It showed not the innocent face of Lily, but a twisted, ghastly version of her, with eyes devoid of life and a menacing grin that chilled Emily to the bone. Frozen in fear, Emily watched as the reflection reached out towards her. The cold glass no longer separated them, the barrier between worlds had been breached. The specter of her sister whispered of a dark truth, a tale of a cursed mirror hidden within the walls of the house, a mirror that held the souls of the damned. Lily's spirit revealed that the house was alive, feeding on the sorrow and despair of its inhabitants. It had lured Lily into its trap, and now it hungered for Emily. The ghostly figure implored her sister to find the cursed mirror and shatter it, to release the trapped souls and end the house's reign of terror. The apparition faded, Emily was left in silence, her heart pounding with the weight of her task. She knew the house would not let her go easily. It whispered through the creaking floorboards, moaned in the wind, and watched through the eyes of painted portraits. Armed with nothing but her determination and the flickering flame of a candle, Emily embarked on a harrowing journey through the house's twisted corridors. The walls seemed to close in around her, and the darkness was alive with the echoes of those who came before her. In the depths of the house, Emily found the mirror, its surface swirling with an otherworldly mist. As she approached, the faces of the damned appeared, their voices beckoning her to join them. With a trembling hand, she struck the mirror with all her might, shattering the glass and unleashing a howl of the trapped spirits. The house trembled, its foundations cracking as the souls ascended, leaving behind the shell of a once malevolent force. As the storm outside ceased, a single ray of sunlight pierced the darkness, illuminating the room. Emily emerged from the house, her ordeal behind her. The reflection in the window now showed only the peaceful streets of Rainwood, forever changed by the courage of a young girl who faced the reflections of the damned. 